right, guys. No, for real, y'all. I'm not making this up. I'm not, like, coming here and making this up like I have issues. No, I seriously had an issue. This is seriously what's happening. My roots started to match. You know, like, I'm on my third week, almost my fourth week to my mini fits, and they're, like, matting in the roots. Like, literally. Okay, so, pictorial. So, let's say these are two mini fits, right? Wait, can you see it? Yes, these are two, okay? So this is the root of this one, and this is the root of that one, and in the back is where I was having the issues. Literally, like, they're right next to each other, right? Wait, my They're right next to each other, right? These two roots of these two twists, they will intermingle the roots and, like, not match. Oh, my God. I was so, like, literally, literally, that's what's going on in the back and I was so freaked out and you know what else? I had like this small one of the you know you don't do all your mini twists exactly the same size and one of them I was like really really small just by chance and for real you know where the twist starts you have your new growth right and then where the twist starts it's just a little you know it feels like a knot but it's not it's just a twist literally it felt like it was gonna pop or something it was so dry it was so awful feeling i was like oh my gosh this twist feels so weak and i know i haven't done a protein treatment but i you know i didn't feel like i needed to i know my hair needs protein but it was like freaking me out i was like oh my god i have to say a prayer real quick so this is what i did i realized why why it felt like it was really weak and really like messed up right there it's because i've been going to bed sometimes my cardinal rule for hair growth do never do this i've been going to bed without wearing my or sleeping on because i sleep on a satin scarf or a satin pillowcase i haven't been doing any of that i've just been going on a pillow or on the bed sometimes i don't sleep on a pillow just on the cotton sheet okay like don't do that i'm like oh that's why because right there was rubbing against the cotton sheets or the cotton pillowcase, whatever night that might have been. And I was just like, oh, no, I get it. And then I had to be like, no, no. I gotta make sure I sleep on my son's scarf or wear, wear the scarf. I had to tie the scarf. And it can't be the sand satins. If y'all been following me for like over a year, you must know that the sand satin scarf messes with my hair. I cannot use that. It rips my hair up. Oddly enough, it really does. So I have to use a genuine satin or genuine polyester normal scarf not the sand satin ones because those have a special texture on the inside that actually rips up my hair and rips up my hair so i can't use them i use a genuine satin or polyester scarf I that's what i've been doing actually because i was like so like on watch for my edges around here in the back i was like no nah, i need to make sure i tie that baby down with a polyester silk Thing. You know those fake silk polyester, that's what I've been using and it works like a dream, okay? So that's the working issue averted. As far as the matting issue, that had to do with it. That actually helped me with the matting. What I actually do now, it's still matted, but I feel like when I finally take them out at the end of this week, that it'll be fine, you know? It'll be like, I'll be able to finger through the, the mats because sleeping just bare on the cotton pillowcase and on the cotton sheets, that was assisting in the mat because you know you sleep on your back. And the back ones, which <laughs> oddly enough, I had the most new growth as well. I was having the most matting right there. Alright guys, so you can tell that my voice and my <laughs> mouth are out of sync. They're not moving in tandem. Okay, so I have to do this voice so that happens sometimes okay basically what it was i saying i'm saying that in the back of my hair you know because i sleep on the back it is matted and so on and so forth in that area because of sleeping on the cotton sheets and sleeping on the cotton pillowcase so as soon as i started using the polyester satin material not only did it stop that popping issue on the side but it fixed the matting issue as well you know i could finger through it it's not exacerbated it's cool okay so that was really a serious issue and it's only in the back as i was saying it's in the back so because i sleep on my back and on my sides so on and so forth you get the picture okay so I continued on to say that I can't wait to take these mini twists out because, you know, I'm in my last week and I'm super excited because mini twists, even though I know how to 
tackle the debacle with my scalp, my dry scalp situation while the mini tooth are in, it's still not the best thing. It still makes it more difficult for me to just have a free and happy scalp while my hair is in mini tooth. So I'm really excited to take them out just because of the scalp situation. And then I was saying that I just came from the James Brown movie. I don't really talk about movies on this channel, but sometimes I do. It's just that great, okay? You gotta go see that new James Brown movie. It's currently in theaters. The actor that played in there, he is so cute. Oh my gosh, he is so fine. Besides being cute, he's just like really, really good. He could dance. He got them dance moves down. It was great. It was excellent. So how is it just that movie? And Lucy. I really want to see Lucy too. I got my eyes on Lucy. I'm so excited to see that movie. But yeah, the James Brown movie is the bomb. We did it excellent job and that's it that's all i hope you enjoyed this video and if you haven't already don't forget to subscribe and i will talk to you later